Hey everyone, in this video we are going to cut up our interview. Okay, we're going to take our 10 second long kind of straight interview, cut it up into some bits that we can start using, down to about 40 seconds. Let's jump in. All right, to get started we need to find the interview and you really need to just have a listen through it. So it's in your audio bin called interview.mp3. Double click it to open it in your source monitor and just listen to it the entire way through. So whenever I'm doing a project like this, I'll listen to the interview all the way through and then come back and do a rough cut, okay, rather than trying to do it all in one big go. You need to get a sense of how this thing kind of balances out and where the good bits may or may not be, but I'm not marking it, I'm just listening to it all the way through. The other thing is, is often I'll listen to a little bit a just to make sure years ago. the audio is good. But I'll, I don't mind if they speak in um, uh, chipmunk voice. So I'll stick at the beginning here. And we're gonna go back to some of our shortcuts. So remember looking at your keyboard, there's that JKL keys. Okay, you rest your three fingers on them quite often when you're editing. So J goes backwards. Hang on, this is a of food. Weird. Uh, K is stop. Okay, and L is forward, for plays once. So you tap it once, it just oh, yeah, plays so a normal view. K to stop. If you double tap L, it plays in chipmunk. <laughs> Well, uh, I take a shower, I brush my teeth. Uh. So I find I'm happy listening to it and just tapping it twice to go to mild chipmunk. I can't go any faster than that. I can't really understand what's going on, but I often listen to everything in chipmunk view and be surprised when that goes back to normal and they go all kind of slurry and drunk sounding, but it's their regular voice because I've been listening to it at super speed for so long. So uh, pause the video now, play through it, have a little listen to it. It's about 10 minutes, okay? And uh, you can watch it in chipmunk view if you like and then come back and we'll do some editing. Okay, so you've listened to it. A uh, few little things just to mention is that at the beginning there, he asked him what's for breakfast. There's a few kind of random things and it's basically just to get um, and talking for sound check to, to make sure that the microphone's is recording right, it's not too low, it's not too loud, there's no background noise, and also to get um, an actual bit more comfortable with the interview process. So you can imagine it's pretty stressful, so you want to get him kind of laughing and kind of joking, just try, try and release some of the tension in his voice. So that's why he started talking about he had nothing for breakfast. I don't know, nothing. Obviously, you're not going to be included in the interview. Another bit was, uh, where is it? It's about kind of here. Let's have a little listen. What, what it was like, how hard it was, just things like that. And say, and start the phrase, just say, when I first started part. So we asked them to start with the phrase. Basically, this particular um, video, we don't want an interviewer, okay? We just want the interviewee. So he, Armin's going to start asking basically himself the question and answering it. So there's no need for an interviewer voice and recording him. Okay, otherwise we'd have to introduce the interviewer and that's not what this is about. So it's very common to have that. So he'll answer his question. Well, when I first started doing parkour... So when I started, instead of asking him a question, he just kind of like answers, well, kind of suggests what he's about to talk about and then answers it. And that's the role of the interviewer and often it's the sound engineer or the director or if you are doing it all, you're going to have to practice a little bit about making sure that there is some context when people start answering your questions. Anyway, next we're going to do is start cutting it all up and get a rough cut into the timeline. Now to do this rough cut, because we are going to follow along together, I need you to grab the exact bits that I do. So we are going to practice copying and pasting time codes. It's going to be good practice, <laughs> mainly for copying and pasting, but I want the same footage in here. So what I've done to make it a little easier is in your exercise files, okay, inside of exercise files under parkour, which is project five, in your copy folder, I've got this parkour interview time codes. Open that up. Okay, and basically we're going to copy this first bit. Okay, and just grab it all. You'll notice that they don't start at zero, zero. Okay, they've started their time code uh, four hours earlier, okay, or five hours earlier. You can set your sound equipment and your camera equipment to all kind of start at the same time. Okay, so even though they're individual machines, you can kind of have a joint time code. So it's a bit hardcore, but and that's why it starts at a random time. Okay, so what we're going to do is make sure your interview.mp3 is open, click in here, paste it in, hit return, and it should jump to the exact position. Okay, now it won't work. Um, well, let's get this one going for the people that did work. We're going to set our endpoint. Okay, remember I on your keyboard. Now we need to jump to the out point. If yours didn't work, it's probably because you've got that selected. It won't work if you have this space over here because um, Premiere Pro doesn't know what to do with it. So you've got to make sure you grab just these letters. Okay, so none of these. Okay, so I'm going to do the second one and grab just the numbers. OK, 
Okay, and I'm going to paste it in here and hit enter on my keyboard. Maybe that's what I didn't explain as well. Hit enter on your keyboard and then hit O for my out point. Okay, that's the first chunk I want. And what I'm gonna do is you can't drag audio into your timeline, weird. Okay, you're gonna drag the, just the, this little icon down here and make sure you're not dragging it to here because that's not gonna work. Why is that not working? That's right, it has to be on the audio track. So that's gonna be my first one. And I'm gonna zoom in a little bit just to get a sense of it. Okay. I started doing, when I first started doing parkour, jump so far and do all these awesome tricks. So I'm kind of purposely giving you a rough cut. We're going to tidy it up later on. I don't want it to be perfect just yet. Okay, so we've got our first chunk. Let's go through and just cycle through all of these. Okay, um, I'll do one more with you. Okay, and then we'll speed it up. So paste, enter, I for input, or if you're not liking the shortcuts, okay, you can use I for mark in, or in O, uh, just these icons down here. So, you can get a bit of a flow going. Copy over here, paste, set your O, your o out point, drag this in and just bunch them all up together. Rough cut. So I'm gonna speed the rest up. Cool. The last one I haven't put in because you might use this other method. So remember, if you uh, you can use your up and down arrows to kind of flick down here in your timeline. So make sure you're down here in your timeline it's selected. Okay, you can get to the end, and then you can use another shortcut, which is in our case it doesn't really matter if it's insert or overwrite because we're at the end. Okay, but remember your shortcuts. Okay, are full stop and comma, or Americans call it period, I think. So let's go with that one. So you can get a bit of a flow going. Now what you would have noticed is that, have a little listen to where we're at, Sorry, what then. we've got. You'll notice that I've cut bits out and I'm, in this particular interview, I'm not uh, afraid to move things around, mainly because it's this, it's the type of thing it is. You, you just gotta be really, I guess I would, I'd wanna draw your attention to uh, changing the way that the interview comes across with editing, you can get into trouble, okay, um, from the talent, or from the public, okay? But in this case, it's it's pretty, there's no sensitivity in here, and we're just trying to tell a story. We're, we're making Armin uh, look better by cutting out all the ums and ahs, okay? And the interview process was just a bunch of questions. It wasn't a particularly, you know, um, strategized interview string to not be edited. It's meant to be edited. So I've cut little bits out and strung them together to kind of make it feel more fluid. Okay, that's my disclaimer. Uh, let's get into the next video. All right, that's it for this video. If you enjoyed it, give the video a like. Consider subscribing to the channel here. And also, if you wanna go a bit further with Premiere Pro, consider checking out my Premiere Pro Essentials course. There is a link in the description. Bye now.